Hi, I'm Elaine Marks from um, Art Life Art School and this is Larry Hyde. He's from the Rotary Club of Polonia Aurora. We're doing this amazing fundraising. Every year we do it for the past several years. It's been such fun and our artists are so much enjoying painting charity squares for the Rotary Club. It's going to such a good course. And um, we've got so many paintings inside our studio as well. Last night was wonderful. We sold 50, I think more than 50 charity squares and 24 big paintings. And we are so excited. We've got bonfires here. We've got homemade soup and fresh rolls and wine and sherry and great company. And only 50 rand. <laughs> Entrance is only 50 rand. And people ask me, how do you do that? And the only answer is everybody contributes. We've got a huge, wonderful community here. People are bringing soup. Everybody's just helping and it's just wonderful. So if you want to really have a great evening out with your family, kids are so welcome. Just come and join us and get some culture and have fun with us. Okay, and then the money will be contr uh, contributed to who? The money goes to the John Wesley Community Centre this year. That is our beneficiary through Rotary. It's also part of it. Yes, John oh. Wesley Community Centre. Okay, yes. all right. So you're going to be here from when to? Yes, so we are here tonight, of course, last night, tonight, and then tomorrow night and Saturday night. Every day we open at 4, and we kind of try to leave by 9 o'clock, but sometimes it's 11 o'clock, so whenever people, you know, people have so much fun by the fire and... It's just great. So just come, join us, have some fun, and do help us with this fundraising for the Rotary Club. They've got really, really good causes to help. And you get a bottle of wine, a glass of wine. Oh, a glass. A glass. <laughs> <laughs> so let's take you inside the tent. This is where things happen. One night, why don't you do so it's still early, not many people yet, so you can actually see the tent at the moment. Can you maybe tell us more what's this? So our charity squares, each student is encouraged to paint the charity square and sometimes, you know, well always the, the teachers as well, some of them paint more than one. Some people will paint 10 charity squares and some paint one, whatever they can do. And as I say, these boards were all completely full last night. And um, we've got just over half left over now. So how many artists do you have? We have about 80 artists contributing. Are they here today? Some of them are here. Every night some different artists attend our are you? So this is the inside of our studio again, and here we could maybe do a quick walk through while it's still a little bit quiet, and you can see some of the artwork we have from all our students and teachers, and then some miniature artwork as well. These are really, really fine detail paintings, if you want to maybe come a little bit closer and see them. Maybe hard on the phone, but really, really worthwhile coming to see this. And people actually use a magnifying glass to be able to see all the detail. You just walk right through the whole studio. It's several rooms of art, only filled with art. As you can see, there are some red dots. All the red dots mean it's already sold. So when are they taking it home? Um, in next week, Tuesday, Wednesday. Then we'll, some will deliver and other people will collect them. Another room for the art? Of course. <laughs> and then our brag room is our children's room. What is the artwork in here? done by kids under 18 years old. And we have some very proud parents and kids okay. showing their work. And here's Maxine. She, she's going to live here. She's one of our young artists. Yes. Okay. Been here for many years, Max. Yeah, for about five now. I'm very proud of you, You're doing so well. Thank you. What have you painted? Is there anything that you've painted in? There's mine. Can you, can you go and explain what is it all yeah. about? Um, so, I use photography from a sort of 
like a dreary monotone book because I know that monochrome or monochromatic paintings would sell and I kind of need some money but I also really like the dynamic I see, the reflection and the actual trees and I put this branch here in order to break away from the centeredness and draw the attention away from just the center. Well done, okay, well done. How old are you? I'm 13. Oh, okay. Right. Thank you.